Hello, my friends. This is Jennifer, and I am back with another video, but this time it's happy mail, Christmas happy mail from my friend Alma. Um, she is Sintang Mayumi here on YouTube and also on Instagram. I am very good friends with uh, them, them meaning Alma, Sintang Mayumi, Cheryl is another uh one she is Cheryl Sabado here on um you, um YouTube and Helen um Crafty Mama Diaries so I have I always link their uh YouTube channels in my description box but anyway let's talk about the um happy mail that I got from from Alma so this is my second time filming this because when I rewatched the first video that I made yesterday, because I received this yesterday, December 15, um, 2022, there was just too much crinkling from this. <laughs> and um, it really doesn't bother me when I watch um, videos that have crinkling, but I know there are people that don't like that. So I had to refilm, and that's what I'm doing right now. Um, so let's start with this that was in the glassine bag. <laughs> so had you watched me, unearth these from this you would have hated me if you don't like crinkling but anyway Alma knows that I love little knickknacks ephemera is my favorite um these are not exactly ephemera but they can function as ephemera because these it's these are wood and can you see how oh my goodness there's another one here this one it's so shiny I don't know where she got these they're just uh, makes me so happy having these because they're not heavy and they're not thick, even if they're wood. So I just laid them out there. If you want to look at each one, you can pause the video. But there it is. OK, so I'll put that away. And then another thing that she gave me are these um, hand sewn um gingerbread so this is supposedly my husband wally and this is me <laughs> or is it the other way around maybe this is maybe this is me because this is an apron and i am kind of bigger than my husband when it comes to weight <laughs> so you got this right alma because wally has really thinned out i think he has lost 40 pounds in the last year so this is accurate <laughs> this is so cute so much detail so much detail i love this thank you so much for sharing handmade stuff with me i really appreciate that that's the best gift is handmade stuff right um i didn't send any handmade stuff to her because alma you know i only make cards so and i know you have a ton of cards so i didn't bombard you with that so but anyway look at this other one isn't that a gorgeous uh, oh and i know that she uses dyes to cut these out and the dice come with the where you can stitch you know the holes where you can stitch so that's what she did with this oh my god and it even has that metal hanger how beautiful is that look and it even says handmade by Sintang Mayumi and these I'm not going to use these as tags these are these are going to be you know what these are ornaments actually so oh and I didn't notice this the first time it says there Handmade by Sintang Mayumi. So these are going to be ornaments that will go up our tree. Just like the previous. And these were tags. These were not ornaments. But I've been using them since I received them from her. Um, I think these are two years old or three years old. Now I'm not sure anymore. But these go to our tree every year. I just took them down so um, to show you here in this video. The other things that I got from her are these bells. These are from Hobby Lobby. And um, in one of our conversations, I said that I can't find those cute bells that have Santa's face. So, and lo and behold, she gives me one pack. <laughs> She's so nice. And then this one, I, I have, I love cute notepads. And I love this um, because it's Christmassy and um, it's so cute. And I love how red it is. Wait, where did you buy this, Alma? Doesn't say. Maybe Tuesday morning. But I'm going to make good use of that because I love notepads. And then she knows I love dice more than stamps. So she gave me 
um, this Elizabeth Craft Designs um, dies and it's Merry Christmas. And she knows also that I love sentiments because I don't like stamping. So, I mean, I, it's not something I enjoy. Let's just say that. Um, so when I make sentiments, I, I, I mean, when I need sentiments, um, I love things like this where I can just die cut it because I'm more of a die cutter. Even Jen, Jennifer McGuire said that she loves um, die cutting more than stamping. Um, and then here's another one, Alma. You got me this. Um, good thing I didn't get, I didn't get this, uh, at Hobby Lobby at that time. Um, maybe I knew, I kind of knew that you were going to get me this, <laughs> but this is so cute. I love gnomes. Alma doesn't like gnomes. I love gnomes. So this is perfect for me. And this is from Hobby Lobby. <laughs> and then she knows me too well. She knows I love poinsettias, anything poinsettias I love. And I love holly and berry like that. See that? So she's, she said in the card that when she saw this paper pad, she immediately thought of me. So I, and I already opened it just for the sake of, you know, speed in this video. All right. So I'm just going to flip through the pages real quick. There's a ton of paper in here and oh my, oh my gosh, how do you not love poinsettia? Ugh, that is so beautiful. Just beautiful. And I love the navy blues. I know it looks like black, but it's navy blue. And it's this paper. Oh, that's navy blue again. Navy blue is just so elegant. I love it. And then look at that. Huh, that's just so beautiful to me. Thank you, Alma, for gifting me this. That's so sweet of you. And then, of course, I got chocolates. <laughs> Three Musketeers. I'm going to share this with um my family because um i can't afford to be eating too much because we're gonna be eating christmas dinner and then uh, new year's dinner and that's a lot of calories and then here's another one i'm wondering if i can use this on uh it's white acrylic paint hmm. this acrylic wash off it says cloth right there where's that it says cloth right there but um because i wanted to you know, mark my kids stuff so that they don't lose them. Um, but I think acrylic will wash off, huh? Anyway, oh, does that say pigment ink, strong carving for sunproof and water? Oh, it says sunproof and waterproof. Oh my God, Alma, how did you know I was looking for white ink that I can use in cloth? I swear you could make a career being a fortune teller. Maybe try that as a side gig to paper crafting. <laughs> and her beautiful card, you guys, because she knows I love um, poinsettias. She gave me a poinsettia card, which she stamped this. I know this um, This is a wooden stamp, and um, I know that she she colored this, and um, she flicked gold, gold ink on it. I forgot the um, ink that she uses. It's a watercolor ink, but it's shimmery. But, oh, my God, that's so beautiful. And I love the message that you put in there. Thank you, Alma, for um, this happy mail. Um, I thank God for your friendship. I hope we have many, many more years of friendship to come. Um, I've never seen you in person, but it's like I've known you forever. Again, thank you. Merry Christmas. Thank you all for watching. Thanks to all my new subscribers and to all my old subscribers, too. Thank you. Bye. Merry Christmas.